Year after year, these women are brought together by Alessandra Belloni, a singer, choreographer, and shaman. Will you dance? A paper rose in her hair and a spider on her chest. Alessandra claims that she is returning to Tarantella its original meaning, which has been forgotten in her motherland. Raise your hands higher. According to her, since ancient times, this dance was danced by women in order to cure illness and psychological trauma. And it was not called Tarantella, but Pizzica. Your illnesses were known to the ancient Greeks. Even the back guy by Euripides tells the advice of the oracle at Delphi, which was given to women suffering from depression. You must surrender yourself to Dionysus, and dancing in his honor will unleash your sexuality and illnesses will pass. It's starting now. Now the real coven begins. I spent several days at the villa with the bake. They taught us how to play a tambourine. Great. Let your sensuality out. Close your eyes. Let Close your eyes. Let yourself go. They dance all types of pizzicas from Calabrian and now to Sicilian. Look at each other. To do rondelays. And to the right. And whirl until losing consciousness like Turkish dervishes. It seems that this group gave the role of Dionysus to me. Stretch, stretch. Relax. Stretch, stretch everybody. Keep breathe. Strong sound. Louder. Inhale. But in order to be a god, you need to have a good sense of humor. <sighs> and exhale. <sighs> Get rid of all negativity. All the toxins, all the venom. The python's poison, all the bitterness and stress, get it out. I was diagnosed with cancer. I started conducting these seminars after I myself was cured of cancer. Doctors forbade me to dance and insisted on surgery. I was very scared. I was young. But I went on stage to dance Pisica, remembering all the women it helped. Immediately. The very next day, the disease receded and never came back. So it's real. These are not just some legends from the past. During the 15 years that Alessandra has conducted her seminar, women who suffered from unhappy relationships, violence, or the death of loved ones came to her. She had one treatment for everyone, rhythm. And I know the six, eight rhythm is This is a very ancient shamanistic technique. I studied it in Southern Italy, Brazil, Cuba, and North Africa. In all cultures, the 6-8 rhythm is used to put people in a trance. And while they are in an altered state of consciousness to help them achieve a revelation or a cure, but you have to allow yourself to You have to allow yourself to lose control. It's really about losing control. So, how does it work? You really, you really want to know? Yes. Go with me, we will dance Pisica yes. Tarantata. Alessandra gives a personal example of how you need to rave and let go of yourself. passes off the ribbon to me. 
white dresses, red pieces of cloth pass in front of me, and when a tambourine starts playing, I obey the rhythm and let my body dance freely. It seems that at that moment, I let all my poison out and stopped being ironic about what was going on while the bacchanalia continued. I have not read Euripides, but I can confirm that dance really is the best remedy for depression. southern tip of Italy, Tapulia, in the Salento region. Earth, red and burnt by the sun, dusty olive groves and white cities. This is where Pizzica was born. The provincial town of Terrapaduli is the only place where an amazing tradition of male pizzica sherma, a dance duel with swords, has been preserved since the Middle Ages. The ancient dance has been preserved to the present day by the country folk. I head to a lesson in traditional pizzica in the local community center. In the other direction. The moves are simple, and they promise to teach you to dance after just one lesson. You just limp on one leg, and it's already a dance. So simple. This is a village courting dance. A man, while raising his legs high enough in order not to get stuck in the mud, catches a woman and uh, runs away in small steps. The most important thing is to show persistence. Uh, next one. For some reason, it reminds me of a pizzica sherma. And I think I'm overdoing it with pressure. Not so close. Keep some distance. The peasant dance has always been somewhat reserved and even crude. But in the 90s, Pizzica was the subject of a sexual revolution. A new sensual style was born. Pizzica Quar, which comes from the word for heart. It conquered all of Italy. Even 20 years ago, Apulia was considered to be the backwater of Italy, with its wild southern traditions, like the gypsy knife fights or dancing bacchanalia, and it embarrassed the civilized northerners. Today, Pizzica is a brand. Hundreds of thousands of tourists come to Apulia just to see it. It hosts Europe's largest traditional music festival, Knights of the Tarantula, where this year's headliner was Goran Bregovic. What's going Do you on dance? Pizzica and all dancing. So oh, a, you are a dancer. Listen, don't ever ask musicians to dance. It is a bad idea. Okay. Anyway. So tell me why. But you are playing Balkan gypsy music. Why did you come here? It has to be. I'm from places where music alone is not enough. You need to add madness. Madness, not only music. Because and when you hear the rhythm of a pizzica. It drives you crazy. That's why I'm here. Go out of your mind. Please welcome Maestro Bregovic.
They say that this year the festival's final concert was attended by 150,000 people. And it's not common to just stand around and listen to the musicians. Everyone wants to show off. People bring tambourines and arrange pizzica cuare dancing competitions. Make the circle wider, make the circle wider. I feel like the village idiot. The peasant dance they taught me looks ridiculous here. The girl teases me all the time, plays with her foot, seduces me with her eyes and hides behind her scarf. I cannot stand it, so I grab the scarf. I am immediately taken off the dance floor. Next one. Tell me, what did I do wrong? When you dance with the woman. Yeah. You cannot take the scarf. Only the girl can give it to you. This means she liked dancing with you so much that she agrees to everything. Why were you shaking your head like this? It looks like a no, but in fact it's a yes. And when I was doing this, I was calling you. Come closer, my mama's not around. When people talk without words, that's what dance is. The Nights of Tarantula is not just one concert, but a whole series. Moving from site to site, you can see how Pizzica is mixed with Balkan folk, rock, rap, reggae, And of course, trance. And you'll find more impressive Greco-Roman ruins elsewhere. Apulia has preserved the most lively part of antiquity, its rhythm. Come to Apulia and dance.